Hi, my name is Jim Burrow from howtobuildablog.net and on this video I'm going to show you how to add and remove extra users. And so for this I'm going to use one of my test websites and so we go into our dashboard go down to users all users and users is where you add additional people that you want to allow access to your website. Right now, there's only one user, and that's me, the administrator. As a side note, the person who installed WordPress, when you went through the setup and asked you for username, password, that kind of stuff, that's this person here and it cannot be changed, added, I mean, or deleted. You can't edit and make changes. I can't change the username. Cannot be changed, but I can change everything else. Put in the websites, and um, should be the, yeah, generate password. So I can change everything to me except I cannot change my initial username. Okay, so let's go ahead and add a user. You can, add it, you can go to all users or you can click here, add new. Either way. So I'm going to go up here. I'm going to add my guru, Marcus, Marcus Campbell. So the username is Marcus. You got to remember that. Email. Uh, I'm going to use uh, my daughter's email. If I can remember it. This is the email that this information is going to be sent to. Or come from, uh, just so you'll have it. Uh, first name, Marcus, last name, uh, Campbell, and I'll just uh, use my uh, daughter's website. Again, that's another test site that I use. A-T-T-P, L-E-I dot com. That's how she spells her name. Her name is Lisa, by the way. Curiosity. A password. You can use the one that WordPress gives to you, or you can change it, make one up. So what I'm going to use is, is Marcus1. And it's going to be confirmed. And I'm checking this to send all this information to me, to this address. So just click Add New User. And if all goes well, you'll see the new user, Marcus, right here. And this is also where you, you delete it. We'll come back to that in a moment. Let's just go in and verify that Marcus can get into my website. Uh, let me pause the tape. I'll get out of it. Okay, we need to go back into... Uh, in this Marcus user, I forgot to change his role, what you want him to be. So if you make a mistake, this is how you do it. And the role, what I want him to be able to do. You have uh, different options. He can be a contributor, add posts. He can be an author. He can edit posts, pages, or administrator. Well, I have no other reason to put Marcus on this site as a user unless I want him to have full access to it. So I'll make him an administrator. Now, let's go down and save it. Okay, we'll now log out. And let's log back in. Ah, sometimes the fingers just won't work. And the username was Marcus 1. We should be able to get in. And there we are. 
Okay, now of course we can view the site. And Marcus has full access to the whole website. Okay, now let's go ahead and delete them. In other words, he's done his changes uh, for demonstration purposes or whatever. And I don't want him no longer have access to the site. So I'll go back into user, all users. Okay, um, notice that I don't have access to it. Well, I guess maybe I do. Let me see if I can delete it here. Normally, if I was signed in, see how this could show the delete? Uh, I could delete it, which means that if Marcus wanted to, he could delete me. So be careful who you allow in. Anyway, it looks like I can delete Marcus from this, uh, even though he's the one that signed in. Let's find out. There's no valid user, so I guess I'm going to have to. Uh, hope I'm going to have to go sign out and uh, and come back in. So let me pause the tape. Okay, I'm signed back in under me. So dashboard users, all users, and now see how the delete come up for Marcus. I can now click on it and delete all content. Yeah. Attributes all contents to Burrow. I'm not sure all that's about, but I'm gonna leave it up there for uh, delete all content. Confirm, and there it is. Marcus is gone. He no longer has access to this website. And so that's how you add and remove users to your website. Uh, if you haven't added anybody at all to your website as a user, you should only see your name. Okay, my name is Jim Burrow uh, to, from howtobuildablog.net. I hope this was very useful to you.